Well, we're in this position of being on a record label and entertainers, and what we present visually and theatrically and musically makes people think about some things maybe that they don't otherwise, makes people act certain ways they don't otherwise, gives them a different feeling in general, stimulates a different set of emotions than most groups stimulate. We are different, and we'd like to be thought of that way, not as weird or a threat, but just different. In other words, okay, you can you can have Christopher Cross and and you can you know Kim Carnes and REO Speedwagon and all that when you want it, but if you want something else, here's Devo. And you know that just hasn't been in general made clear because of the way we're processed through the meat grinder. So we think of, we think of our music in visual terms anyhow. We, we think of the things we do simultaneous visual and audio. So it's more of a whole picture. I mean, we end up spending almost as much time making the videos as we do recording the record. And we would spend more time, but we're on schedules and contractual commitments. We're, we're, you know, we're in a business reality and also the obvious bottom line of budgets. Well, you know, we're not complaining. We do what we can with what we can do right now. And it, it has made it much more obvious to people what we're about because it's the added dimension that's necessary. People tend to romanticize chaos and idiocy and reflect it in the music they buy. And I suppose New Traditionalist was uh, just Devo doing what it has been doing, but presenting it in another way. You know, it, there isn't, it, we're not presenting chaos. We're not presenting a lot of banging and screaming and, and uh, you know, Things, things that you find on Top 40 Radio. Mark, let's talk a little bit about uh, one of your songs, It's a Beautiful World. Uh, tell us a little bit about that. You say it's, it's a beautiful word for maybe for us, but not for you. We just think the only ugly thing on the planet is man. It's like some horrible virus that planet Earth has been afflicted with. Usually when you hear somebody go, oh, he's a beautiful dude, at least in our camp, we can, we can bet that he's not. It's the very fact that, that that's being Just said. The inside feeling of the person? What do, you, what do you mean by that? Yeah. Mark was, you know, Mark's being facetious. Things are upside down. Planet's great. Everything's there. All kinds of information, all kinds of resources, all kinds of possibilities. And people make sure that they limit themselves, create a one-dimensional reality, black and white world, you know, total waste, mental waste, physical waste, environmental waste, on every level. On every level. It's just, you know, incredible. But yet you get people who say that everything is beautiful. Just like they, they don't see at all.